Today we're going to talk about moving your video files to YouTube in order to clear up a lot of space in your Google Drive. Video files take up more space than most other types of files. So if we can get them into YouTube, we would really uh, minimize the amount of space we're using in Google Drive. So there's a few different ways to do this, but um, if you've only got one, uh, let's say you go and find the video in your Google Drive and you select it, all you have to do is right click or two finger click and say download. And you'll notice right down here in the bottom left, it's downloading and it'll be done in a few seconds depending on how big it is. Now you're gonna go to your YouTube channel by just, you can go youtube.com, you can go from the waffle menu, you're gonna hit YouTube. And then right over here on the left, you're gonna click your videos. Be sure you're logged in as you, as your district, uh, as your district login, okay? Um, now, these are all your videos. You may not have any if you've never done it before. Now all you do is go to create, upload videos, and you can either, if it's still down here, you can grab it and just drag it, uh, drag and drop right here, or you can click select files and it should be in your downloads the you know the latest thing i usually go to recents but you can see um the latest thing that you've uh downloaded it was called video playback there it is and you would just hit open okay and it's going to upload your file and then here you can change the title you can give it a description you can choose a thumbnail or just let it choose one for you you can go to playlists. I have a bunch of them already created. If you want to kind of categorize your stuff, you can just click new playlist here, create a new one and put it in there. You don't have to do that though. And then here, um, audience, you're gonna wanna say, yes, it's made for kids if you made it for students to see, okay? Then you're gonna click next, 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 all the way to the last uh, screen. You're gonna wanna change to unlisted, okay? Because if it's private, then no one can see it. You're gonna choose unlisted. And then you are going to simply click save. And that's it. You've got your video up on YouTube. It may take a minute or two to finish completely processing. As you see right here, it even gives you a percent. It's checking it. Um, it's checking it and it'll be done in a few seconds. Okay. So now um, here is your video. And all you have to do is grab the link to it. You can click here on view on YouTube. You can open it right here. Okay, You can get the link from right here copy it, go paste it wherever you need to, okay? Let's say you want more than just one. You wanna download more than one video file in order to put them up on YouTube. All you would do is find them and select them I'm using a little checkbox or you can hold down the command or control key as you click. Um, I'm going to try to select a few small ones for these video purposes, but um, so select as many as you want, okay? And once you have them selected, once again, you can right click and choose download, or you can come up here to the three dots and choose download either way. This time it's going to do what we call zipping the files. Because you're downloading more than one, it's going to zip them. It's going to compress them so it doesn't take so long to download. Now they are zipped and they're down here on the left hand corner. All you have to do to unzip them is click on it. Okay. Once you click on it, it unzips them and they're ready to go. Okay. They're right here in your downloads folder under drive, download, whatever. They're right there. Okay. Now let's go over to YouTube from the waffle menu. You could have youtube.com too, but right over here on the left, click on your videos and you'll be in your channel. And just like before, when you uploaded one, you click create, you click upload videos, but this time you click select files and you're going to come in here to where they were and you're going to hold down the command or control key and click as many as you want. Okay. And I think it'll do up to 15 at a time. I can't remember. You'll see as you go. And then you click open. Now, you don't have to do one at a time. Now, as you can see, it's uploading all of them um, on, on its own. And now you will see them when it's done. You'll see them right over here. I uh, may have to hit refresh. There you go. You see the three that are currently, they're uploaded, but it does a check and things like that. So, but they are there. 
And just like the rest of them, you can go through each of them. You'll want to make sure that visibility right here is unlisted and not private. Um, you won't be able to do it till it's done processing. Okay. But again, you can open each of them by clicking on the title, give it a title, give it a description, change the thumbnail, select a playlist, say, yes, it's made for kids. All of this stuff, just like you did when you uploaded just the one. Okay. Make sure it's unlisted and then you can click save. And then you will see the link to it right here. If you want to grab it there, you can hit copy and get the link. Um, if you forgot to grab it, you can always come here and you can click on one of these to get the link. Okay, there it is. Uh, get shareable link and you can copy it there. So that's how to do more than one at a time.